this time on Fishing and Adventure. Oh, yeah, that's a massive fish. There what is a big one! Oh! <laughs> This week, we are continuing our Northland adventure out from the small far north settlement of Whangaroa. We launched Holy Ship on dusk and spent the evening in the harbour loading up on fresh baits before a solid sleep in the cabin and an early start chasing our challenge fish. The challenge is set for each of us to land a 30kg table fish, and so the first order of the day was to set our game lure spread and target yellowfin tuna. It was a slow morning on the game fishing front with no sign of tuna, and the only fish we managed to raise was a big Marco shark, which got the adrenaline pumping, but definitely wasn't our target species. With the consequence still on the line, we decided to pull the pin on the game fishing and have a crack at a few deep drops over some promising sign we picked up on the Raymarine. Things were not going our way, and as luck would have it, we hooked another Marco shark, which gave Mig a hell runaround and wasted a good 45 minutes of precious fishing time. Get up, Dan. Whoa, wait, that's a big old Marco. Woo! We then finally managed to somewhat turn things around and hooked a frost fish, which, although stunning looking, was destined to be turned into something bigger. That something bigger came in the form of a couple of nice blue nose, but unfortunately, they were still a fair way off our 30 kg challenge size. What do you reckon? One of the best eating fish in the ocean? It's right up there. It's right up there, right? It's right up there. So yummy. All right, let's get another one. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Let's go. With a pending consequence and only a couple of hours of daylight left, we decided to stick to the deep drops in the hope that a last minute bass or hapoku would turn up for their late afternoon lunch. The deep water slim jig from Black Magic. We'll drop that down there. Hopefully make it to the bottom and uh, drop that down and hook a challenge fish. And it'll be consequence for me. <laughs> I think this fish is gone yeah, anyway. Is got him. One? So I've got you, huh? Yeah, you have. Yeah, oh, no, you got one. a fish. What are we talking, Migsy? Hopefully another frosty. Probably a frosty oh, fish. Brown, red. Brown. Red snapper. No, um, Alfonso, oh, um, ruby Alf fish. Ruby, ruby fish, fish, is it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well hooked, eh? I'm the oh, it's a good yeah. size, eh? Mate. Hell yeah. Nice oh, bite catch. Oh, look at this. Another weird deep sea species. We've caught one of those before over in Hokianga that time, remember? Oh, yeah, yeah, A couple yeah, of years yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yes. So either Alfonso or Ruby fish, one or the other. Good eating as well. Yeah, real good eating. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's a cool little fish. Nice catch on the jig, Migsy. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting another, oh, like a Jimmy or a Frosty or something. But that there, what a cool. So we've got a chance to get this challenge fish, and I think he's going to go and split in half and put him down, I reckon. Oh, be rude not to, I think. Very rude not to. All right. I've heard of people using crayfish. Gurnard. Gurnard, paraki. Uh, who would do such things? One last try to see if we can't. Go home without a consequence, or at least one of us. I'll be happy if one of us, even if it's Mick, doesn't have to do a consequence. Let's yes. be honest. You guys all want to see me do the consequence, don't they? So I think don't so. They? Well, they want to see Mick do another one. I do. I'm, yeah? I'm not, I'm not but you, Jander, what do you want to see? You got a sore foot? The Alfonso oh. stabbed you in the foot. <laughs> he wants to see a plaster. <laughs> he got sliced in the foot by Migs Alfonso. Keyless placement, Mig. Oh, I'll put it Sorry, there, it? Ruby fish. Sorry, my bad. Yeah. I think it's Ruby fish. Let's just sink off the bottom there. All right. Flapped up of Alfonso slash Ruby fish. Ruby fish, I think it is. And that there. As I've said before, and I'll say it again, it's hopefully going to catch my challenge fish, because he's last baits. Maggie, what are you going to go with, mate? Double whammy? Yeah, mate. I'm going to go a bit of the Frosty, another one of the Mackies, hook him through the, uh, hook him through the tail, get lots of hook exposed, and uh, those two baits there is as good as I can do. Do it. Do it for the lack of consequence. Down she go. We go uh, one for one on this combo. We obviously came out hoping to target tuna. Um, but they aren't playing ball, so 
Deep drop. Thankfully, we've got this combo on board. Never leave home without it now, don't we, Mick? That's it. We could use one of our other big combos, but... Yeah, yeah of course we could. Nowhere near as much fun. Yeah, this is good, good fun. to use the, the 30 wide on the jig rod. Yeah. Good sport as well. Wicked. It's a bit of a grind, but you're not using a harness or anything, but that's all right. Part of the fun, eh? Part of the fun. Enjoying it. Something's very interested in this bait. It's a big bait, though. Need it to swallow, obviously. Pooker, though, big mouth that has come in, grab that bait, and it should just be a case of, you know, shouldn't need to let them run with it. They should just be able to grab it, basically down the hatch, and then this circle hook will just roll into the corner of the mouth. But currently, I'm just getting pecked at by something a little bit smaller, I feel. It's definitely interested. Oh yeah, I'm getting some, still, I'm still getting some good wax over here, but I'm more bloody wax than a candle convention. But they're just not turning into solid hookups. It just keeps on letting go. Like something's grabbing it, pulling it, and it's not swallowing it, or the hook's not setting. So I'm wondering whether there's, uh, there's been issues. See, look at that, loading up big time. Ugh. See, look, fish there now, right? Quite a bit of weight. Like that's heavy. That's a heavy fish. See? Oh yeah, that's a massive fish. Here, yeah, boys. Holy. Here, yeah, boys. Holy okay, yeah, boys. Okay, I think we, I think we might have hooked him. <laughs> oh, yeah, boys. Yes. Oh, look at that, Ben. This is a beast. How many seconds? <laughs> How many seconds? Jeez, a ruby fish. Sometimes you just need that. Oh, I think. Oh, it's right at the bottom. <laughs> Let's come here, Mick. Come on, Scotty. Let's go. <laughs> this is it, boys. I'm going to put the call out there. Let me get it up. Ah. Take it easy. I love the ruby fish. Let's go. What's going on over get there? In. Oh, I don't know, mate. I've got <laughs> 300 metres and 350 metres of line out, and 150 of it's top shot, so. <laughs> If my last bait's anything to go by. <laughs> this is a beast, this fish, boys. Look at it. It is a monster. Absolute beast. <clears throat> this is a recce. This is me table fish. And I've as per Meg on the last baits. As per. As per. <laughs> as per. That sign was there. All, yeah, exactly. the, all the elements oh. were there, and we lost a couple of good fish today, so. This is a stop. It made sense to persist at the spot. Absolutely, yeah. And when you find a spot like that that holds some wreckfish, you just want to keep trying, keep trying new areas yeah, around Yeah, very much it. so. Awesome. Get back on that. He doesn't like that. Every time I try and get some on him, eh? This is a big fish, man. I was really hoping this is a target species. Good work. Come on. I want to get this thing in. That's what he's doing here is keeping the bend in the rod the whole time. It's so easy to do the lift and the wind, but drop your tip too fast, and especially with braid, that makes a big loose spot where the hook can just fall out, especially at this, at this end of the fight where the fish is quite close. Come on now. Where are we? But it's been a big, hard fight. Yeah, a long day. It's been a good day. Oh, man, we jammed some stuff in, I tell you. Have we walked? That's all you can do when you get up early and make the most, sleep in the boat, do all that sort what of stuff. Like, here's this angle now. Here comes the angle. Come on. Here comes the Here angle. Come on, Ben's got some colour, has he? Floating up. That swim bladder's inflated. Surely. Come on now, surely, surely. Don't be that one of those pesky Marcos. Oh, you're fine, Mick, it's going. What have we got, Mick? Oh, there it is. There what it is, is it? Ben. Oh! 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 Oh, that's definitely a wreckage. Oh, it's definitely that's a monster. That's a beast, bro. Oh, that is wow. a beast. That's a beast. Absolute beast. Woo!
Oh, epic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're looking big round, bugger. Yeah. That's what we've been looking for this all day. pays off. What a it start, does. man. We'll be bloody keeping this one close Absolutely. to our chest. Absolutely. Oh, a few blue nose, frost fish, ruby fish. Man. It looks like a big old pooker, eh? Yeah, it does like a pooker. bass. Oh, I'm assuming so. Oh, oh finally like found it. the right bait, eh? We needed a bigger bait, and it was big that old big old fish. flapped up, butterflied ruby fish. Yes, <laughs> a beast. Here we go. You want me to lift him? All right. <laughs> This is challenge fish, no doubt. Surely, surely. This, is challenge yeah. fish. this is challenge fish, Scotty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. bro, man, Cheers, that's bro. epic. What yes. a spot. Yes. Yeah, Marlin live bait rig again. That's a deal. Not far from falling out, to be fair. Oh. Bro, Whew. that is there epic. There we go. And on the last bait, which Mick thankfully caught. Thank you, Mick. Anytime. I'll contribute that half of that fish to you for catching that lovely ruby fish. Does that mean I don't have to do the consequence? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if people no, take home one day. I'll take a consequence for that. <laughs> oh, oh, man. man. That's some good time. Oh, well. Jamming my fingers. Oh, gotta grab them in a different area. Uh, oh, get oh. up there, Scotty! <laughs> <laughs> That's mean. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. That's as big as big. Woo! <laughs> 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 All right. Bro. Oh. That's me. That's awesome. Yeah, Find a spot like that. Yes. Got what some baits down. 30. Okay, oh, not, yeah, 32. 32. 31, 32. No, 33. Yeah, there it is. Oh, the, yeah, 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 yeah. The bottom of yeah. that. Yeah. 33? 33? Yeah. Mick? What do you reckon? 33? It sort of bounces around between 33 and 35. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah. 33. Well over anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah. There he is. Yeah. That's, That's a big it. fish. That's Bang. a big fish. All right. Got the mouth on that guy. Bang. Obviously, these fellas got an appetite for ruby fish. That's a dinosaur, right? That's such a cool fish. We don't target these guys a lot because there's not a lot of catch and release with Harpooker. And we see if you need a feed and and the other reason is we don't catch these guys a lot is because we're not very good at our deep drops. <laughs> <laughs> Let's be honest. For the most part. Yeah. But today, we've flipped that one on its head, Mick. That's and look at that. You see that there? That's razor sharp. Like, if I was to run my fingers on that, I'd slice them. So that's just the gill plate protection. It's just like armour. So they're a solid species, not a lot of predators. Look at that big rudder as well, eh? Big old tail on it. Yeah. So they can, they can put in the miles when they need to. They can, they can swim quite fast. And this fin here, like a bloody, it's like a bloody stegosaurus. But look at that, it just tucks away. See how it all tucks away all nice and see a little big groove in there for it? And it actually tucks away and then out they come from their big holes and bang, lights out. Alrighty, just dissecting this um, pooker. And there is something very interesting in his belly. Could be the baits, could be some of our previous baits. Ooh. Oh, this is so oh, exciting. What do we oh, got? It's a ruby. It's a ruby. It's, it's your, a... is it the? No. No, it's another much? one. No, it's your one. Uh, no. Is it not? No, no, yeah, no nowhere near as much. That much. No oh, wonder. It's another no ruby. No wonder he hit so hard. Another ruby. He's on the ruby charge. Well, I can tell you where that'll be going. Yeah. Down to the bottom. We <laughs> <laughs> found his last bait. back down there. Big found his last bait, all right. Nice. Yeah, all righty. We'll rig those up on the single rig, and we'll uh, pop that down in front of the sign. Sounds bloody good to me. All right, let's get it going. Oh, there's that ruby fish we found in his guts, and it's uh, rude not to drop that back down again. Let's go. Get him, Mig! What is that point? Come and see if you feel this feels like how it felt before. Oh, hang on, though. Wait for it. Look, we've got a massive. Yeah, yeah, I suppose. You want to do the cut there? No. Oh, yeah, hang on. Oh, that's pretty heavy. Oh, there's a fish on there, bro. Oh, OK. Yeah, bolt. Grab it. Yeah, Oh, that's <laughs> Is that a fish on the bottom? It's massive. Couldn't be the bottom. No, it's a fish. <laughs> get it up, get it up. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's a fish. Oh, God. Holy hell, mate, get oh, it up. Oh, God. Challenge fish, mate, get it up. Yeah! Come on now. Ruby fish! Ruby, Ruby, Ruby! Ruby. Ah. Ah. Do you, do you, do you, do you? Oh, it's another 
a stonk as well. Oh, it's da, 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 da. <laughs> oh yes, boys. <laughs> Too good. Look at that, we we're done. We we're done two hours ago. Phew! Oh. <laughs> OK, we don't need any more after this, because that's a, more than enough food for us. The good thing about this, too, is that it's the one hook. Yeah. It's only going to be one fish. That was the whole idea of dropping back to that one hook rig as well. And that's the four fish we'll take home, and they're four fantastic fish, if he gets us in. I'm, I'm hoping he gets us in, because, you know, we all want to see a consequence, but we do enough consequences. It's time that we uh, turn the tables around. What do you reckon, Mick? I reckon. <laughs> I, reckon the, I reckon the punters can do a consequence for this one. I reckon. Wait, what about the camera crew? Jandal? So, uh, ben Lardin? Ben? So, uh, punters out there. He's not keen. Oh, God. Oh, he's stripping. You all right, mate? So, punters out there, if you're keen, do a consequence for this one. Chuck it up on our Facebook page. Tablespoon of wasabi for you guys this week. Yep. If Mick gets his fish in. If I get this in. I'm already not doing a consequence. That's, I'm just happy to see whatever comes. Happy. Oh, that particular fish. ruby fish has been consumed by two different harpoka. <laughs> one very unlucky oh, ruby fish. Ruby. A well utilised piece of ruby fish. Yeah. Can't be too far off, Migsy. How's that angle? Can't be far off, mate. It's coming oh, up. There he is, there he is! It's just there! <laughs> oh, it's a beast! beast. It's a beast! It's another beast! Oh man, it popped up right away. I thought there was heaps of line to go. Ooh, yeah. There it is, it's another monster! Oh. Wow! Yeah, mate. Yeah. <laughs> is he bigger? Is he smaller? Is he the same? He looks freaking huge. He's a barrel. Look at the size of him. Man, these things are big. He literally looks like a pig. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. You might have a, uh, might have a consequence avoidance on your hands there, my friend. Maybe, maybe. What's like, is it a bass? Is it a bass? Oh, I hope oh, so. Maybe. Yeah, uh, it is. You reckon? I think it, oh. it might be, eh? It's, maybe it's, not. It's fat. Look at his eyes are popped out. Books. Yeah! Oh, go! Yes! Watch the deck, watch the deck. On there, on there. Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> oh, holy oh, crap! God. Bad! Oh, one. that ruby, ruby, ruby. Ruby. That one I had was, like, longer. This one's just fat. Oh, what? Yeah, he's just a big, just a big, fat pook. Pook, eh? yeah. He's got a big, fat puku on him. Yeah! Oh, yes! yes. That's a beast. And it's gonna feed the whanau for sure. Awesome. Mean fish. This is a bass, it's not a harpoka. Oh. All right, you ready? Oh, oh. my goodness, there's a little stingray. Oh, a little stinger. <laughs> Some sort of deep sea stinger. What's that, that's oh. a raised bream, no? What, what no, 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 raised bream. No, like a um, skate, skate, like, yeah. that's what I mean. Like yeah, a rough yeah, skate yeah. or something, but... Awesome, look at that. And we've just established look. that, I'll just look at this fish again, it's definitely a bass. It's not a harpoca, that's 100% a bass. Different tail, look at the width of the tail and the de denseness in him and the fact that the eyes pop out more and it's barely an underbite. It's about the same, I reckon that's a bass. I'm gonna call it. Yep. That's epic, goes to show the size of what these guys eat on a daily basis and then, you go, and then they go for more. Yeah. <laughs> it just folds up, up in a nice little parcel. Straight in. Here you go, sir, here's your stingray burrito. Look at that, it's like <laughs> epic, epic little fish in its own right. Yeah. Down there at 350 metres, feeding away little dinosaur. Yeah. Sort of stuff you hardly ever catch. Nah. Tea, you love the tape. Are you consequencing? Oh, 31. On the knocker, on the knocker. Mate. On the knocker. <laughs> yeah, it's over. It's definitely over. I'll give that to you, my man. Epic. Nice. Hey, stay. Right awesome. on the very right. last, 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 last bait. Very last bait. <laughs> <laughs> no better way to do it. Extra time. That was it. All right. We'll All catch right. you next week, and you won't catch us doing the consequence. No, you bloody well won't. Yo! Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. It'll really help us grow this channel and bring you guys way more content. And if you want to score some of our epic FANZ merch, then click the link in the description below, grab yourself a tea and a hat, and uh, we'll catch you on the next adventure.